This is the new G5 command centre for the new C40 and C100. Like the previous models, all the water connections can be found at the back of the unit. The new interactive LCD is found on the front of the unit and is used to control the hydro tap and turns it on and off. The filter door houses the internal filter, which needs to be fitted during installation. All chilled water commercial hydro taps for 40, 60 and 100 people now come standard with a vent tray. This is to make correct installation of the hydro tap easier. Here's what you should receive in your new G5 hydro tap box. A command centre, the vent tray, braided hose, IEC power lead, quick guide instructions, which include a QR code link to the installation video you're now watching. You'll also receive the tap or faucet ordered with your hydro tap purchase. The tap or faucet installation videos are separate to the command centre videos and can also be viewed on the ZIP website. To install your hydro tap correctly, ventilation is critical to its correct operation. Two cutouts are required in the lip of your cupboard floor. One is for the cold air inlet grill, the other is for the hot air outlet that the vent tray sits on. To install the vent tray, place the vent tray in the cupboard and align the vent tray so you have enough room to also fit the inlet grill to the lip of the cupboard. Mark and make the cutouts. Fit and secure the cold air inlet grill to the cupboard. Then line up the vent tray with the back of your hot air outlet cutout and secure with the screws provided. Fit the outlet duct to the front of the vent tray and secure the duct with the screws provided. The command centre will then slide easily onto the vent tray. Fit the outlet duct to the side of the command centre. As the duct seal is new, fitting to the unit can be hard. Use the supplied talcum powder to make the fitment easier. Just gently apply a small amount of the powder around the seal and secure the duct with the screw found on the side of the command centre. Next, remove the dust caps from the outlets and remove the cap from mains in. Next, we need to connect the command centre to the mains water supply. Use the supplied braided hose for this connection. Connect the end with the elbow to the mains in on the command centre. Your Zip Hydro Tap also comes with an inline filter. Connect this to your mains water supply. Do these connections up finger tight and then tighten the last quarter to half a turn with a shifting spanner. Next, connect the other end of the braided hose to the inline filter and tighten this the same way. The tap of the hydro tap is electronic and the communication USB cable needs to be connected. Connect the female USB cable from the command centre to the male USB from the tap. Make sure you orientate them correctly and you should hear a click when the cables have been connected properly. Once they're connected, wind up the cable and secure it at the rear of the cupboard. This is just to keep it out of the way of mechanical or water damage that may occur in the cupboard. Next, the hoses need to be connected to the command centre. The blue hose is for the chilled water out. You need to have constant fall from the tap to the command centre. Measure and cut the silicon hose to length. Push the silicon hose onto the nib so that at least 15 millimetres of the nib is covered by the hose. Cable ties or clamps are not required as the silicon hose will hold itself to the nib. Next, plug in the IEC power cord into the hydro tap. The command centre no longer has an on-off switch and power on-off is now controlled via the LCD. The filter for the hydro tap comes loose in the filter compartment. Open the filter door, remove the plastic wrapping from the filter and fit the filter into the filter head. Locate the filter, push up and turn clockwise. The filter will stop turning when it's in place. An innovation from Zip Water is HydroTap Clean. HydroTap Clean is a naturally produced cleaning product that's gentle on surfaces and pH neutral. HydroTap Clean has been specially designed for HydroTap chilled and sparkling water paths. HydroTap Clean is to be used during the commissioning process of your HydroTap, which is the final step in installation. Almost all the process is automated so that every hydro tap can be commissioned to the same standard. However, we've introduced a few steps, so please watch this video closely to see what's new. The hydro tap has been designed to be used frequently and straight after use. Do not start the commissioning stage if you're not planning on using the hydro tap for a few weeks or months. Wait to commission the hydro tap just before you need to use it. 
The first screen on the LCD also reminds you of this. From the commissioning screen, press the arrow. On the next screen, the date and time can be adjusted to suit your time zone. Touch the screen on the date or time to change it. The time can also be changed to 24 hour time. The next screen asks you to select the drain away option. This simply means if your tap or faucet is installed to dispense into a sink or the specially designed zip font. If you select sink container, the flushing process from the tap will be automatic. If you select font, you'll need to use the tap or faucet to dispense water during the commissioning process. Next, the internal filter needs to be flushed. Using a bucket, place the filter flush hose in the bucket and open the stopcock. Press the play button and the filter flush process will start. This process is timed to take two minutes. If you need to pause the filter flush, press the pause button on the LCD. When you're ready to resume the filter flush, press the play button. Once the filter flush has stopped, turn the stopcock off and give it a shake. Press the arrow button to go to the next screen. Put the flush hose back in the filter compartment and close the filter door. Next, we need to prime the HydroTap system. This means that all the water paths inside the HydroTap will have water pass through them for the first time. Press the play button to start the system priming. Water may dispense from the tap or faucet during this process. Once complete, we need to prepare for the HydroTap clean process. You'll need a microfiber cloth, HydroTap clean adapter and a HydroTap clean can. Both the adapter and HydroTap clean can are supplied with the HydroTap command centre. First, fit the cloth underneath the internal filter. This is to catch any water that may spill in the HydroTap when you remove the filter. Next, remove the filter, and once removed, refit the dust cap of the filter to keep the filter protected. The adapter must be fitted to the internal filter head first. This adapter will fit in and turn a quarter turn before it's secured in place. Make sure the filter flush hose is off. Next, remove the green lid from the HydroTap clean can. The can is designed to screw into the bottom of the adapter. Gently fit the can underneath the adapter and tighten. Press the next arrow and the next screen wants you to confirm you've fitted the HydroTap clean can and you're ready to start the commissioning process. Next, the HydroTap will need to calibrate. Press the play symbol to start the process. At the bottom of the screen, there's an arrow button to take you to the chilled cleaning screen. This will show you a picture of the tank and the solenoids inside the HydroTap. This will open and close during the process. Once the flush has been completed, the HydroTap will ask you to remove the HydroTap clean can and adapter. Remove them both separately, can first, then adapter. Both these can be put into recycling. Next, remove the dust cap from the filter and reinstall the filter to the filter head. Mop up any spilt water with the cloth and remove the cloth. Once completed, the HydroTap will start to operate. You can register your HydroTap via a QR code. To do this, press the menu symbol, then register product, and the QR code will appear on the screen. Use your phone or tablet to scan the code and register your product. Please visit zipwater.com for any further help videos or information on your new HydroTap G5.